there's a really good quote and, uh, from Eleanor Roosevelt. She says, today is the oldest you've ever been and the youngest you'll ever be again. So here's your normal life cycle, right? You start off really young. You get up to your peak and then you get older. Why do we age? That's the biggest question. Why do we age? We're going to talk about a number of theories on why we age and then what's the role of ketones in that. So the first thing is the telomere hypothesis. Telomeres, a lot of people have heard about them, but let's make them real simple, right? As complex as they are. They are. Think about uh, a chromosome as having DNA. Now everyone knows what DNA is, right? It has the instructions that make us us. And when you, we're young, that's functioning really well, right? But every time we open up that DNA and use it, there's a cap at the end of the DNA, and those are called what? Telomeres. Now, every time we open up that DNA and use it, that cap gets smaller. And that's one of the theories of, of aging. Then we heard about mitochondria. Everyone knows mitochondria, right? So it gives you energy. And as we age, what happens? We're losing mitochondria and their function goes down as well. So it's the second theory. That's why you're like, man, when I was a kid, I had all this energy. And now I don't have so much. Now, the reason why we want to know these things, because if we can know them, maybe we can counter them, right? The third thing is oxidative stress. And that's kind of, that's a little more complex. We've all heard of it, right? But what is it? Basically with age, we have an increase in this thing called oxidative stress. So you think about it, we have molecules, we have atoms, okay? And in those, on the outside, we have these things called electrons. And basically, you know, every atom, or every molecule needs to have a certain amount of electrons. If you're missing one, basically these, these we, call it a, we call these free radicals. If you're missing an electron, you're unstable, okay? You're very unstable. How do you get stable if you're missing an electron? Right? I would go and take one. So with age, we have, that's called oxidative stress. With age, that increases. Does that make sense? Okay, the last thing is that we're programmed to die. That's scary, right? That one from birth till the end of life, we're programmed to die, okay? So as we, we get, as we get older, these genes turn off. So why do these genes turn off? Well, there's basically, there's these things called HDAC. We've heard a lot about that, right? Basically think of HDAC as these things that turn genes uh, off, okay? And I think that's kind of the take home message. They turn genes off. And what do ketones do? They block HDAC. So basically you have something that's switching the genes off and ketones block them, theoretically. There's studies showing that they keep the length of telomeres longer. They have antioxidant properties and they block HDAC, which means they keep the switch on. So if someone asks you about aging theories, you guys are gonna be like pros, right?